almost 20 a game in Big Ten play. She had 27 and nine. Here she is, got behind the Spartan defense and has her first two of the game. The all-time blocks leader in Husker history. She's got the ball here as Arold almost steals it, kicks it out to Scoggin, and she's got the first three of the game. And it's 5-1 Huskers here in the early going. And that's when Nebraska head coach Amy Williams said that they're so excited about. Arold answers. Winston pulls a deep three-pointer, nothing but net. She was averaging almost 17 a game in the non-conference. Her scoring has calmed down a little bit in Big Ten play, but I'm sure Susie Merchant is glad to see her get one to go as there's a drive to the basket there by Scoggin. Obviously, we mentioned they lost their last one on the road at Ann Arbor, but got consecutive wins as there's a bucket there. The other Australian on this team, other than Bourne, as Stewart saves that one. Bourne shoots the three and makes it. That clock is off. They feed Bostic in the post. They throw a great pass to Crooms and it goes plus a foul. What a look there from Bostic. First quarter letting Nebraska score 20 and that's not a good look to start off. Spartans gave up 93 to the Terrapins here on Thursday night. Here's a three pointer from Porter that drops. Talk she's loud by her game. So when we're not seeing that, it feels really off. Hybe misses the first shot, drops it off to Kane, and she has her first two of the game. Starting around the third, and that's when they really started taking the game away from them. Winston crosses over and pulls into a short jumper that drops. Crooms kicks it to the corner. Winston pulls a three that airballs, doesn't find anything. Hybe with the rebound, but her pass is stolen right back by Crooms. Crooms doesn't have numbers, sidesteps for the two. Her an extra chance to drive the second she touches the ball. She can stay back in zone defensively here. They'll pull a long three-pointer that's banked in by Porter. Tori Osmond looks to run the break, crosses over, gets all the way to the rim and gets the tough two to drop. <laughs> Nebraska trying to get something going offensively here as Michigan State's still in that zone defense, but. They get an easy two there off a great find from Bourne to Cravens. So the first two of the second half for the Huskers goes to Cravens. She's got seven. Clowden crosses over, gets all the way to the rim. That's the Nia Clowden that we know. Skins a zone defense as well. Winston pulls a corner three that's short. Rebound to Cravens, but Osmond swipes it from her. She finds Parks. How about that play from Tori Osmond? Here comes Hybe, Euro step, can't get the shot to fall. Ball's tipped around and grabbed by Cloud, and she throws it behind the back to Winston. How about that from Nia Clowden? Scoggin fakes left, Ooh. but her shots get gets blocked by Smith. Michigan State clinging to a one-point lead right now. And it just doesn't feel like Michigan State is playing fast-paced basketball. Clowden I mean, yes. pulls into a three. Clouden in attack mode right now, kicks it out. Osman from the left wing, pure. Four for five shooting in 24 minutes, so very efficient offensively from Osman. There's a cross court pass to Ruby Porter. She's been hot from the outside and continues to be. Cravens has it. She's got nine points. Good feed in the post there to Kane. It's in Osman's hands right now. She pulls a three that gets blocked. Smith grabs the offensive rebound that gets blocked again. Kane got her. That just isn't possible for Michigan State basketball. We have to see more. This is Bourne spinning baseline and gets the tough two. Rebound to Hybe. Here comes Hybe crisscrossing all the way to the rim and one. Through contact, she took Clowden back in the zone is Michigan State. Hybe will pull a three from the left wing that doesn't go, but Kane's right there to grab it. Michigan State trying to come back here. Here's Cook a three that's well, well short, but Bostic grabs the offensive rebound, cuts it down to three. Michigan State grabs the rebound. They have the opportunity to tie here. No timeouts left for the Spartans. Winston fakes and pulls the three. Oh. Gets partially blocked. Partially blocked by Kane. And Brown gets fouled. How about that from Kane? All Nebraska has to do is stay away from oh, Michigan yeah. State. Definitely no stupid fouls. 
Crooms. I'm not even sure she got it off in time, but it doesn't matter.